U.S. stock index futures pointing to a higher open this Wednesday morning amid key economic data, including the ADP employment report showing private companies added 182,000 jobs in October. Also, September's trade deficit coming in $40.8 billion. That's the lowest level in seven months, while the PMI services index and non-manufacturing ISM they await later on this morning. Now, the U.S. dollar, that remains on the upside in the Forex market. The euro dollar is where we begin, and that's about a half a percent lower at 10909. The British pound U.S. dollar pair point 17 percent lower at 153.94, while the U.S. dollar Japanese yen pair point 21 percent higher, 121.36 yen. Trading Central analysts focused on the British pound U.S. Japanese yen pair. Trading Central analysts focus on the British pound Japanese yen pair, which stands above the support at 186.35 and remains on the upside. Long positions above the support at 186.35 are favored, with targets at 187.30 and 188.05 in extension. On to precious metals, which continue to see negative trade. Gold is where we begin, and that's in focus as gold has recorded a succession of lower tops and lower bottoms since October 28th. The declining 20 and 50 hour moving averages maintain a downward bias, so short positions below 11.30 are favored with targets at 11.10 and 11.04 in an extension. And lastly, silver 0.14% higher, 15.26 a troy ounce. And don't forget to follow Trading Central on Twitter at Trading Central for all of your Forex market updates. And for Trading Central Web TV from the New York Stock Exchange, I'm James Swinney.